Hi everybody, welcome to the Spectator in the Zone post-game show. Ali Schultz here with Miles Simmons and Spencer Giori in Providence, Rhode Island at Brown Stadium. Lions just dropped a 22-6 decision in their final game of the year. Um, Columbia actually got ahead early in the game, but um, was unable to hold on to its lead. Um, Spence, you want to talk a little bit about Columbia's first quarter performance? Yeah, um, Columbia's offense was able to get uh, early lead, six points mm -hmm. uh, off two field goals, but unfortunately they, they could have capitalized early on in the game and gotten a 14-0 lead. They were deep inside uh, Brown territory early, but they weren't able to execute and capitalize and put the game uh, with a big lead. Right. Um, and uh, a big part of the um, reason why that lead did not hold is the Browns offense really, really showed up um, after that after that first quarter. Um, Patrick Donnelly had a huge game. Um, Miles, you want to talk a little bit about that? Yeah, overall today, Patrick Donnelly had 225 yards, three touchdown passes. Mm -hmm. He was really the difference in the game. I mean, he made some really key right. great plays, especially on fourth down in the second quarter. Mm -hmm. uh, there were two instances where the Lions had fourth down uh, in, in Lions territory, right? And so what happened was uh, Brown went deep both yeah. times. Fourth and two, they went deep, and they got a touchdown pass. Uh, and that was with 12-15 uh, left mm -hmm. in the second quarter. And then they had fourth and eight, and they went deep, and they got another touchdown pass. Both were 29 yards, right. and that was with 332 left in the second quarter, and that made it 14-6, to and that's when they really started to blow the game open. Really what made one of those um, especially impressive, at least to me, was that uh, the line, they had just uh, a couple plays before, Brown had seemingly scored a touchdown that then mm -hmm. got called back from a hold. Yep. But, uh, again, the Lions were unable to... Uh, capitalize on that uh, second chance and gave just uh, a couple plays later gave uh, the touchdown right back. Um, Lions actually had a chance in the end. Um, uh, I think Mike Waller picked off a pass uh, at right. the end mm -hmm. of the third quarter. Yes, did. Columbia drove all the way to the Brown, three, uh, Brown two yard line yeah. um, but was unable to punch it through. Um, ultimately came away with nothing and then um, on the next Brown driver uh, shortly thereafter in the fourth quarter again Waller picked up a fumble but um, again the Lions offense unable to come away with anything so uh, disappointing end to a, uh, a se the season for the Lions um, I'm sure they would have liked to have this one but um, definitely some positives to take away from this year uh, a couple of good wins especially uh, at the end of the year against Cornell and Yale um, so uh, thank you guys for watching all year it's been a pleasure um, this is Spencer's last show so um, yep. Yeah, we'll miss you, Spencer. But um, <laughs> be sure to catch us next year. Um, we'll be we'll be bringing you football updates. So um, for Miles Simmons and Spencer Joyce, Ellie Schultz saying so long.